Before we go into how to test a diode, let's first cover what a diode does. A diode allows voltage and current to flow in one direction and blocks it from flowing in the other direction. Uh, it does this with a very minimal voltage drop, very minimal resistance, and we'll be going over resistance in another section. If I were to take my probe and look at the front end of this diode, I see my full AC sine wave um, switching up above, positive above my ground and negative below my ground. If I look on the other side of the diode, it allows the positive pulses to go through and blocks the negative pulses. So the diode is letting the positive pulses, pulses flow through, blocking the negative, and the positive pulses are pretty close to what they were originally. A diode only drops about 0.7 volts or so. So when we do a diode test, let's first turn the meter to the diode position. You notice that this position has diode capacitance, resistance, and continuity. So let's turn the light on here. You need to hit your select button. Right now you start up in resistance mode. The select button goes next to continuity, next to diode by showing a diode in the screen. What you're doing when you're testing a diode is the meter is actually trying to put voltage through the diode and it measures what the voltage drop is across that diode. So now I'm putting my positive lead on the positive side of the diode. It's letting that voltage go through and it's telling me that 0.55 volts is being dropped across that diode. So the diode is good. It's letting positive voltage go through and only dropping a half a volt. If I were to take this diode and reverse the voltage, put the positive there, it's going to block that voltage, not let any voltage through, and show overload in the display. So this shows me that the diode is working properly. It's passing positive voltage through with only dropping 0.5 volts. It's blocking the negative voltage. It's a good diode.